guys, it's Jada Moore, and today we are talking about food. So right now we are in my little kitchen, <laughs> and it's not the cleanest, but we have some dishes. Um, so I do have some dishes and some stuff on the counter, but um, for the most part we're going to be focusing over here today. We are going to talk about the food game. So this is an interesting topic because not everybody wants to gain weight. Like a lot of people want to lose weight, but it's more about gaining weight in the right places. So gaining weight in like your legs, your thighs, your butt. I do be getting a tummy, but that's really due to like too much carbs and not enough um, exercise. So by the way, before I get into this video, like I'm not a nutritionist, I'm not a fitness expert. I'm really making this video because I get so many questions for years about what I eat and what I eat. Today we are making teriyaki noodles with whatever veggies that you want. This recipe is really fun and you can get creative. So we have the stir rice noodles. We have gluten-free teriyaki sauce. We have toasted sesame oil. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but I only add like two drops of that. Then we have red curry sauce. Then we have stir fry soy free sauce. This I use in my noodles. It's really, really good. This right here 
I know that it's in a bag and you're probably like, what the heck is that? But this is vegan meat. It's like chorizo and it's really, really good. It's got a little kick and it's spicy. So I add this as my meat because I don't really like vegan meat. You're going vegan in this meal. And then this is my vegetable. I just got myself a bell pepper yellow one because I wanted to have some color in the food. And then here is my onion. You can obviously add like whatever vegetables you want and much more. And I add some of this because I love spicy food. I need my food to be spicy. So I add a little bit of this at the end. And so a majority of all of this is definitely vegan and gluten free, but you can also add evaporated milk. I just learned about this a couple months ago and it makes the food so creamy and so delicious. But you do not have to add this into your meals if you are going vegan. This is a majority of everything that we are going to be using besides the spices and I'll show you guys later. But yes, and then you see the cilantro and we add that at the end. So, yeah. so now what I am doing is just adding in the olive oil into the pan, into this busted up pan. And we are going to chop up our bell pepper or your vegetables. Now I'm taking my onion and I'm just chopping up my onion. But I like big pieces of onion. I'm just, I'm just weird like that. So now our veggies are in the pan. Like I said, you can do whatever veggies in your pan that you want. As you can see in my pan, my pieces of my bell pepper and my onion are big but don't make fun of me that's the way i like my food so we're just gonna let this cook and we're just gonna let this caramelize that's like the word i like to use caramelize so now we're going to put in our spices so we got garlic salt slap your mama here's your chili powder don't be shy let throw that thing in there black pepper Now it looks really beautiful and you can see the caramelization. We're taking our noodles and we're putting them in the water. And then here is our chorizo. And I know this looks disgusting and like poop, but it tastes really, really good. So let's just mix all that in there and it looks, um, you can see that the meat looks like meat. Then we're putting in our sauces. just mix all that up and here's our noodles they're ready they're done so they go back into the pot here's our evaporated milk and you're just going to pour a little bit of that into the pan and then you're going to mix it all together here's our cilantro and you're just going to spread that thing on there and voila little bomb Yes, honey, it looks amazing. 